Okay, the Park Sloper Senior Wallet Notebook Pen. Size for field notes and other 3.5 inch notebooks with a pen sleeve and card slots for your credit cards. Now, first of all, why is it called the Park Sloper and why is it called the Senior? It's called the Park Sloper because the original idea came from my cousin, the Reverend John Delore, is a singer songwriter who lives in Brooklyn in Park Slope and he figured it would be a hit in his neighborhood. So his, the one I designed for him was the Junior and we also have a medium. So the senior is the largest, the medium is the middle, the junior is the smallest. The junior takes a very, very tiny moleskin notebook, uh, two card slots, pocket here, and it works with a Fisher Space Pen Stowaway, just about the smallest pen you can find. Uh, pressurized cartridge, writes upside down underwater in space, all of that. So this is the junior, uh, the very smallest uh, iteration, tiny, perfect for front pocket, back pocket, anywhere you need it. My cousin came to me and said, I'm sick of writing on napkins. I need a tiny notebook, wallet, and pen all in one. So that was the inception. The medium takes a slightly larger notebook, uh, Rhodia A7. Also, Clairefontaine makes notebooks this size, so they're fountain pen friendly paper. And uh, this one fits perfectly with the Machine Era brass pen, which takes a G2 refill and we sell this as an add-on to the Park Silver Medium. It's a wonderful pen. Um, the slot will also fit other pens, um, most notably the other one we sell, which is the Raw Brass Fisher Space Pen Cap-O-Matic. That will also fit in the Medium. It just won't go down all the way into the slot. Okay, so that's the Medium. Now let's get to the Senior. Senior again is the field notes size. Each one comes with a field notes notebook and it fits pretty much any of the thin pocket notebooks that are 3.5 inches by 5.5 inches. So Word notebooks, Clairefontaine makes them, Moleskin makes them. I mean, there's a zillion of them out there. Um, paper stacks, Forest Choice, there's just a lot. So uh, field notes is the, the most well-known brand and they kind of paved the way for that sort of thing. Um, we use a thicker leather. On the outside, we use thinner letters on the inside. Two card slots here, and you can put an optional two card slots back here as well if you need a little more space. Partially open pocket here means money, receipts, business cards, anything else you want there. Each of these pockets will take four or six cards. Um, and uh, early in the design of the sloper, I looked at doing vertical pockets. And some people request that. It's a very inelegant solution. When this is closed, you'll see this is the one that I carry. Um, you'll see it, it, it's very symmetrical. Once it breaks in, you can see where the card slots are. If you stack vertical card slots more than mm, two or three, and this would be like four or so high, you get this really unsightly bulge, um, and it's just not elegant, not elegant design. And so I stick with the, the card slots oriented like this. And here's a look at if you want the back pockets, that's what it would look like. Just sort of two hidden pockets for your least, uh, you know, less used cards. Now these two are examples of the Park Sloper No Pen. You can find that uh, elsewhere as well. Um, this is just basically a Park Sloper Senior with the pen slot chopped off. And this is the one that I use and love. Um, so back to the Senior itself. Park Sloper Senior will accept tons of different pens. Um, we size the, the pen sleeve so that it fits pens up to about 11 millimeters in diameter. That's a little over a centimeter. So it'll work with the Space Pen cap matic that we sell. It'll work with the machine. Uh, this is not the machinery. This is the tie scribe bolt by um, Kelvin over at um, Urban Survival Gear. This is a wonderful pen. One of my favorite EDC pens. This one happens to be titanium. He also makes it in brass and in copper. That works perfectly with it as well. For a lightweight option, the titanium is great. Also, a bunch of different pens from Keras Customs work. Um, this is the EDK. That fits lovely. And the pen we actually designed it to be sort of the maximum size pen is the Render K. This is a phenomenal design uh, by Dan Bishop, and this uh, fits absolutely perfectly right down there in the sleeve. And that's about as large of a pen as can fit. Uh, also, the Baron Fig Squire is a great match for this. Perfect fit. This is the one in brass. It was a limited run, uh, but they come in all different colors. And also, if you're a fountain pen user, you can put stuff like uh, the classic Lamy Safari. Sorry, that is not the Lamy Safari, and the Safari will not fit. That is too thick. This is the Lamy 2000. And um, 
that'll work well with it, as will something like the vintage retro Rotring 600. I uh, love this pen, and that fits in there perfectly as well. Your really fat fountain pens just aren't going to fit. Um, and this is meant to be sort of a an everyday carry type piece anyway. Now, the thing is, people sometimes worry, like, okay, but if this is going in my back pocket, um, and let's talk about pocket size too, not going to work great for a front pocket, um, but will work really well in a back jeans pocket. And if you position the pen towards the outside of your body, there's really no danger of uh, damaging the pen, breaking the pen, or anything like that. Um, if you position it towards the, the inside of your body, it might be a little uncomfortable to sit on, but in a jeans pocket, or even some khaki pockets will fit it, um, definitely a suit, a suit coat pocket will work great. Um, but this works great in a back pocket, uh, no problem at all. Now what else can you do with it? Well, let me show you mine. Um, I carry the Parks Over No Pen because I find that uh, Usually I have a pen either in my pocket or in my bag or with me, um, so I don't need the pen and it cuts down on the size and makes it ride easier in the back pocket. Um, Park Silver No Pen is what I call this. Um, you can find a full description elsewhere. But um, the other question people say is, well, why, why are there two stitch lines here? A lot of times you see people just with one. Um, here at One Star Leather Goods, we make everything exactly to size. It fits snug, it fits perfectly, and that's sort of one of our design mantras. So here, the cards fit perfectly, very little wiggle room. If you put the stitch line in the middle like many people do, you've got a really loose, sloppy design. Also, um, in the middle there, it creates a little tiny pocket. And in the, in the uh, interest of using that little pocket, well, what can we put there? Uh, let's see. I've got this uh, vintage pocket knife that used to belong to my grandfather. That'll fit in there perfectly. What else can we fit in there? Let's see. How about a spare stitching needle? Or a clothespin? Allen wrench? Titanium keychain pen? Basketball air pump attachment? Q-tip? Fingernail clippers? Or even the key to my in-law's beach house? Point is, there are a lot of ways to use this little pocket here, but it really is to make the card slots fit perfectly. And it is, of course, more work, but um, we firmly believe that uh, when the design is right, more work is always worth it. This is uh, Horween Natural Chrome Excel. You can see the way it ages. It darkens up really nicely. And uh, this is the one I've carried for a couple years now. So that's the Park Sloper Senior. And uh, basically, it's, it's based on a design that we make with or without the pen loop. I, sh I showed you the Park Sloper No Pen. We also make it uh, without the card slots, which we just call the Field Notes Fully Stitched Notebook Cover. That's the base, then you have card slots. You can optionally add card slots in the back. You can have it with the pen, you can have it without the pen. Um, there's a lot of options. If you have any questions, feel free to email us. We'll point you in the right direction. Some people also ask if this can be used with a passport as a travel notebook. And while it definitely can, Passport will fit in there. Uh, the passport's just a little bit shorter, and we actually make a product that is exactly the same but sized specifically for a U.S. passport. So um, you can, again, you can find that in the shop, the passport product. Um, but also, the passport will easily fit. Um, it's the exact same width as a field notes notebook, just a little bit shorter. So um, you can use this as a passport. You can even just tuck it right there behind the notebook. So that's the Park Sloper Senior wallet notebook pen uh, check that out also check out the park sloper medium and the park sloper junior if this is a little too big for your needs see you next time